everyone. Hello, Sato. How are you? Hello, everyone. Hello, yes. We are playing Pokemon today because we have hit the 250, um, goal that we had set. I made a little, I made a few adjustments to all the stuff. As you can probably tell. Um. Hey, Uni. Hello. Good. How's your favorite nerd? Your favorite nerd is doing, uh, doing pretty good. Doing pretty good. And we're already off to in time. Wacky. Wonderful. Okay, the 10-minute comic wedgie is in, and I'll be keeping track of that time. So, uh, I guess I'm doing okay, I'm doing well. I'm doing better today now that my, uh, legs aren't killing me. My legs were absolutely killing me yesterday, it was really hard to walk, and I couldn't go into work. But it was relaxing, so I was doing, you know, my stuff to, uh, hug myself and whatnot. However, as I said, that we are playing... So we're going to be playing Pokemon Black today, as you can see on the screen. Uh, we have the top screen right here. We have the bottom screen over here. And then, um, yeah. A uh, quick thing is that the... Um, sound alerts might be a little broken today because apparently there was an update and I have it. I didn't know. I didn't tell me. So I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna do that eventually and hopefully it works today. If not, I will be thanking people individually as they follow and or sub throughout the stream. I'm playing Pokemon Black because I put a, uh, pull up on Twitter. To has uh, people choose which Pokemon game they wanted to see, and they chose Black. That was a majority vote. Am I coming through okay? Is music too loud? Oh, this uh, background music won't be here much longer. Um, so I changed the sub goal on Twitch from 10 subs to 2 to 5 to 5, not to 5. 5 subs, and I put it as uh, that, that I would uh, continue one of my more light stories if we can get to 5 subs. That is either normal or gifted subs, both, uh, both work, and resubs, I believe, do as well. Yeah. As for... My... Rules. I think I'm gonna be doing, like, the normal Nuzlocke rules. One encounter per route, if you kill the encounter, it's gone forever. If you run away from the encounter, it's gone forever. If Zuckmon dies, it's uh, it's dead forever. Um I forgot what my rules were. I had set like three different rules. One was the encounter rule. Oh, uh dupes cause is gonna be in effect, so I can uh, avoid catching multiples of the same Pokemon. And... I have a little special rule that if a Pokemon dies hero combat and I have to keep it in my party until I reach a uh, Pokemon Center to put it in the grave box. I have to be in an atomic wedgie from the point where it dies 
up to the point where I get to put it in the drive box. So that's my little additional rule for a little community. So hopefully, uh, this goes this goes well. We're playing on an emulator, obviously, as you can probably tell by the star and play buttons, and that is currently making no noise. Huh. Um. So yeah. Uh, with that said. Let's get started. Yeah? Yeah. So, I've not actually uh, played on the emulator for like a long while. So, this is a little bit uh, something for me. Well, that sounds fun. I've never done Nuzlocke, but that'd be a fun rule. That's why I added it. Specifically for our community and whatnot. But okay. Let's get started. Uh, we're gonna start with the new game. Obviously, I have not actually booted up this uh, game, so... We're only going through the actual intro. Hi there. Look into the world of Pokemon. My name is Professor Juniper. Everyone just calls me the Pokemon Professor. That's right! This world is widely inhabited by mysterious creatures called Pokemon. It makes you feel the pain of losing a Pokemon in more ways than one. Yes, exactly. We gotta add those things. We gotta have those fun little modifiers just for us. Pokemon have mysterious powers. They come in many shapes and live in many different places. We humans live happily with Pokemon living and working together. We complement each other. We help each other out to accomplish difficult tasks. Having Pokemon battle one another is particularly popular and it deepens the bonds between people and Pokemon. And that is why I research Pokemon. Well, that's enough from me. Could you tell me about yourself? So, obviously, uh, as I've said before in a lot of these uh, streams where I've been having to, you know, create dialogue, uh, there is a slight delay due to my voice changer as my voice has to filter through the voice changer, so it's, it's a little... To a delay just a little bit. Sorry if that becomes a little bit annoying, but there's always, you know, the text on screen. So, uh, yeah. Um. Da -da -da. I can't really think of much else to add on to that. I'll obviously be playing as the female. Alex, welcome to the stream. Hello, hello. Yes, I am female. To know my name, please tell me. And for this, I believe we can do. Oop. We are Mizo. Yes, we are Mizo. So your name's Mizo. What a wonderful name. Well then, I'm going to introduce you to your two best friends. This young man is Sharon. He can be a little difficult, but he's an honest person. This young woman is Bianca. She's a little flighty, but she works very hard. I think you three have potential, so I'm going to give you a very important Pokemon. Mizo? The moment you choose the Pokemon that will accompany you on your journey, your story will truly begin. During the journey, you will meet many Pokemon and people with different personalities and points of views. I really hope you find what is important to you in all of these travels. And that's right, befriend new people and Pokemon, and grow as a person. This is the most important goal for your journey. 
let's go visit the world of Pokemon. Now, this isn't the, uh, first time, actually, that I've played, uh, Pokemon Black. Or Pokemon White. I think when I had actually played it, I had Pokemon White. Back on my DS when I was in high school. I remember constantly playing, uh, these Pokemon games on the bus on the ride back home, because... It, it was fun. I had a lot of friends that were into Pokemon, so we would just, you know, pick up things and play. Hello, friend! Welcome, welcome! We are just now getting started. Please, oh. I even Professor Juniper, we can have a Pokemon. Not keeping Bianca. Am I a little late again? Sorry! Bianca, I've known for 10 years that you have no sense of time, but seriously. Nerd, I am low on panties, said. Yeah, when you're, uh, running out of panties, it's a bit sad. <sighs> Alright. Ten minutes on the is up. Thank you, uh that 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 name. I Jahara. Jahara. I'm gonna call you Jahara. Thank you for the the the, the wedgie. Anyways. Today's day we can get a Pokemon from Professor Juniper. I know, sorry Mizo, sorry Sharon. So, where are the Pokemon? They were delivered to Miso's house, so Miso gets the pick first. Naturally. I'm uh, just gonna lurk as you haven't played this game since it came out. I have uh, very, very fond and very dead memories of this game. Uh. Alex, thank you for the. Uh, the sub, thank you. I appreciate it. We are one step closer to getting a uh, part two of the Mage Life on DeviantArt. At five subs, I'm going to be working on that story. And when we hit five subs, I'm going to be uh, shifting that goal around to maybe another story, to maybe another event. I don't know. But we're gonna we're gonna find out. Thank you for the wet cheese. Okay, the Pokemon are waiting for us inside that gift box. Yumizo, you are first and take a peek at the gift box. I want to meet the Pokemon right now. Oh, I mean vigil. Yumizo, open the gift box. I've brought three Pokemon, one for you and one for each of your friends. Please settle your choices politely. Enjoy your Pokemon. Pass it, Juniper. Okay! And here we have our first choice. I remember absolutely nothing about game setup, so uh, this initial choice could very well be the end of our run. Uh, but what I do know is that the first gym is supposed to pick uh, whatever weakness your Pokemon has. So it doesn't really matter which one we pick for the first gem, I think. Because there's a few things we get to catch along the way there. So, uh, we have... Nivy! Uh, the grass type Pokemon, the grass type Pokemon, and I think the original Pokemon that I personally picked when going through... Pokemon, black and white. We have Tepig, which I believe is a fan favorite of uh, some people since it made its own character in Smash, apparently. Incineroar. 
No, wait, hold on, that's complete. I'm dumb. Don't, don't, don't listen to me. I'm completely freaking stupid. Oh my god. That is, uh, not the correct Pokemon. My apologies. Um, the Pokemon I'm thinking about is actually from, uh, Tiny Newton. I'm dumb. I didn't play that game. And it was, uh, Oshawott. Uh, the water type Pokemon that turns into a very uh, good water type, I believe, actually. Uh, Simurot, I think it is. I believe Simurot, uh, the Oshawott line. <laughs> Alex's name gives you PTSD from Yu Yu Master Duel. Uh, well, Alex actually. That the Sword Soul Alex actually is a, uh... It is a very big Yu-Gi-Oh fan, so... That makes sense that it would... Settle. Uh, and not call you. And then... My braid is all over the place, I am so sorry. <laughs> and mess up is forever immortalized in this stream, which will be posted to YouTube. So... Uh, I don't know how to do polls, so I'd like to see opinions in chat. No, that tech inside that. Yes, I should do. I'd like to see opinions in chat on which Pokemon we should go so for. Quick play of the want. Okay, okay. That's one for Ashwan. Personally, I don't really mind which, uh... Oh, Sphinx. Haven't had that one in a while. Oh, hello? Okay. You probably can't hear those. My mic is weird on what it likes to pick up. Uh, actually, I need to be right back, so if you guys could leave your opinions on a Pokemon in chat, I will be back in like a minute or two. Third shiny, thank you for the wedgie news. Yeah. It... I... Um, what did I miss? Ashwa doesn't necessarily have advantage against any of the gyms except one, but it's a solid Pokemon and it's cute. 
Epic is cute. Take us to Nivy. Cause you gotta think on if there's any fire, water, or grass types in the roots you want. Oh, uh, that is true. Uh, I know that there's a fire type that's also kind of like a fighting that I can get. I think it's like the Roman Romanitan or something like that. I like that one's pretty good, so I probably wouldn't choose Tepig and... Water types are actually quite common, but so are grass types, technically, I guess. Uh, I think I might go with Snivy. Snivy's honestly my personal favorite from this gen. Uh, yeah. Yeah, well, we'll go with Snivy. I honestly expect throughout this entire playthrough to have to be constantly restarting. So, I, I don't mind if uh, I have to restart every now and again. This is the Pokemon I want, yes. And if uh, running with Snivy doesn't work very well, Grass type moves can get them just again. Very good. Um, if the run with Snivy doesn't work, we'll change it up. Next run we'll go with Oshawott. If we fail the run with Oshawott, we'll go with uh, the run with Tepig. And we'll just constantly use Shift throughout the start of Pokemon and see which one we like more. Throughout the playthroughs, if we don't somehow manage to one-shot this game, which I highly doubt we will. Okay, I'll take this Pokemon. Sharon, that one is yours. Hey, how come you get to pick out my Pokemon? Oh, Misa, you do remember the goal that gives you the monkey right? Yes, yes I do. That's one of the reasons I'm not worried about the first gym. Nope, never mind. I wanted to pick on the start anyways. Everyone has chosen the Pokemon, so that's that. Hey, I know. Let's have a Pokemon battle. Honestly, Bianca. Even though they're still weak Pokemon, you shouldn't have Pokemon battles inside a house. Having a Pokemon battle inside room is definitely not a great idea. be a war reward. These little ones are weak, like you said. We have to at least let them battle so they'll get stronger. It's settled, Mizo. Get ready for a Pokemon battle. Let's go! First battle! Let's hope we don't die! It'll be a very, very short run if we die. Break the Wii. We could break the Wii, and it's very possible we may. So obviously, since we're like low level, we don't have any actual grass type moves to use against the Oshawa yet. So I'm gonna just take my chances and just spam tackle. You're kidding me. Restarting real soon. We immediately got crit. How was that my luck? I swear to God. Okay, it just spammed Tail Whip. Oh my lord. This was the first battle, I'm already stressed out. How is it that I immediately got crit? 
That's so stupid. And my room's a mess. But the Wii's okay. Well, that's some BS. Yes, it, 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 it certainly was BS. Wow. Mizu, you're gonna be an awesome trainer someday, I can tell. No doubt. Uh... Bianca, would you like to take a look around? Poof! What happened? Ah, Pokemon are amazing. So little, but so strong. I'm so glad that I get to have a Pokemon. Oh, I'm um, sorry about your room, Mizo. You are completely hopeless. Here, I'll just throw you a Pokemon for you. Now, Bianca's Pokemon. Mizo's Pokemon needs to be fixed up too. Sharon, how about you battle too? With all you know, I'm sure you can bow without turning the room into a disaster area like I did. I believe you're right. I'll be no problem for me to keep the row from getting any messier. Besides, it's not fair if you two are the only ones who get to have a fun bell. I just noticed that my plant has been knocked over. My plant. It's decided. You'll be my opponents in our first Pokemon battle. Let's see what you can do, Tapeg. I forgot that I have to nickname every single Pokemon I catch. I did forget about that part. Okay, let's not get crit this time, please. Thank you, game. Thankfully, it doesn't have any fire-type attacks to use against us. That bit used to tackle. Okay. We did not get crit. We do deal slightly less damage. Which is a little troubling. Because the next attack kills us. Kill it. Eh, they threw. They threw! Easy peasy. We win. And for the people that are indeed uh, wondering, this is a uh, light Nuzlocke, an easy one, because I'm not used to running them. So, we're not doing no items in battle. We're not doing, like, set mode. And I'm, I'm using, and I'm allowing myself to overlevel if I feel the need. Or if I just actually do so. So, like, that, that stuff's not in effect. We're doing this at our own pace, we're having fun with it. I made a strange blunder in my first battle, but that's this feeling I have. I'm finally a trainer. But first we better go apologize to your mother about this messed up room. Oh, I better come too. And we have officially gained control. I don't know how to access my... Oh, ah, that's the button. Okay. I had the wrong one. Alright. We have officially started uh, the game. So let's go. At 
probably what I'd do if I did a Nuzlocke. All the usual rules sound like it'd be way too tough for me to have fun with it. I'd want to do a hardcore Nuzlocke, I just need to get used to actually... But the thing is, an actual Nuzlocke isn't like no items in combat. Like, it, that doesn't, that's not a normal Nuzlocke rule. So Nuzlocke is just... Like, first Pokemon dies, nickname every Pokemon, one capture per root. That's a Nuzlocke. That's the normal Nuzlocke rules. Uh, the ones that are like, satin mode, no items in combat, no overleveling. That's hot. That's a hardcore Nuzlocke. That's, that's not something that I'm doing. That's not something you have to do. That's not a normal Nuzlocke. That's a hardcore Nuzlocke. I'm very sorry for about- I'm very sorry about all the trouble, Mim. Well, um, we can clean up. Cleaning up? No worries. I'll take care of it later. Shouldn't you be on your way to meet Professor Juniper? Yes, thank you. Please excuse us. But let's go thank Professor Juniper. Are they waiting in front of the Pokemon Research Lab? Oh, wait. I've got to go home first. Thanks for having us over. Hello, Mum. My, my, Mizo. Pokemon battles are so lively, aren't they? I could hear the Pokemon's cries clear down here. <laughs> that sure reminds me of my first Pokemon battle. is sending me stuff on Discord. Oh, I have just gotten good news from a friend of mine. Lily. And brother had their brother has made it sack safe and not safe. Words. Their brother has made it home safe and sound. Very happy for them. Oh, and you know, after a Pokemon battle, you need to rest your Pokemon. We're gonna be doing a lot of that. The Pokemon is looking great. Now, if you're going out, don't forget your cross transceiver. I forgot that was a thing. People are messaging me on Discord. This is not a great time. You're going to think the professor too, right? Better get going, honey. I'm gonna take a drink. Quick, quick. Oh, right, don't have the running shoes yet. Those are P doves, if I remember correctly. Sharon's house, I don't want to go there. We gotta check on Bianca. No, no, a thousand times, no. I'm a good trainer. Hope got a Pokemon and everything. I 
can totally go on an adventure. Oh, it's okay. It's fine. Sorry, my thing is constantly lagging. Okay, what do you think you need? Yeah, it's been a while since I've done this one. Okay, five minutes, let's go. I'll be waiting for you in front of the lab, okay? Uh, if I remember the storyline is that Bianca's dad is very protective and is against her going on a, uh, Pokemon adventure. Okay, let's go meet the professor. Hi there, I've been waiting for you young people. Let me introduce myself again. My name is... Professor Juniper. We know your name. Come, come, Sharon. This is not a time to take things lightly. Yeah, it's overprotective. I really like sharing Bianca's stories in these games. Uh, I played originally through black and white. The originals, I never actually played Black and White 2. So if I actually do complete this nest, like I might do a casual run of that game. Today's the day to remember always, so it's best to behave with some formality. That being so, once again, my name is Professor Juniper and I am researching when and how the creature is called Pokemon came into existence. Oh, that's unusual. You've already had a Pokemon battle. So maybe that's why... It feels as though your Pokemon have already begun to trust you. By the way... Would you like to give your Pokemon a nickname? Yes. Alright everyone, what are we gonna call our Snivy? It is a male. Do we have any volunteers in chat that would like to sacrifice themselves in the name of the, no in the, name of the run? Hey guys, we've done those locks on this channel before, and I'm quite sure everyone remembers, our starter always dies. Because I am extremely careless. So would anyone like to take the place of our starter? Otherwise I'm going to... Oh, maybe, maybe like a, a theme we want to go with throughout the game. I remember watching a... Artie's playthrough of this. I've seen it like a few times over and I remember that he went with... A naming scheme of a uh, failure, pretty much. No, that was that was interesting. Uh, but personally, I would like to uh, kind of name the Pokemon we get after people in chat. We normally don't have a lot of. We normally don't have enough people to actually, you know, do that with. I'm hoping that, uh, we at least get some people to participate. If I don't get, if I don't get any volunteers, then I'm just gonna try to think of a name to give it myself. Which is a lot harder than friggin' teams. Apparently, I'm bad with names, especially I'm bad with, uh, names for males.
Someone else can have Snivy. I don't know. It doesn't look like anyone's really uh, volunteering, so I might just name it myself. Um, what to name you? I haven't made any male characters myself. So... I don't want to spend too long on the naming scene. Uh, maybe I can name them after some D&D characters. That's much better. In which case... I'm gonna name you... Miko. I know that the name... That you guys can actually see the name. As it's hidden behind all of the stuff. I have to put, like, I have to put this screen up here. Because otherwise, it's, uh. It, it'll be, like, two different screens popping up, and I didn't know how to actually fix it any more than that. Got it. You're not great with names either. Ever since you started naming all your prime members, you usually end up. Defaulting to anime characters you like. That's fair. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna go with uh, uh, NPCs from my D&D games that I run off stream. So, this one is gonna be named Nico. M E D K O is how I spell it. You okay with the name Nico? Yes. I pressed B. E. The setup for the buttons is weird. I need to change it. Nico is its name. That is such a great name. As for why I gave all of you Pokemon, it's for the Pokedex, right? Sorry, my sibling just got home. I'm talking with her for a few seconds. Give me just a little bit.
My sadling likes to talk. Alright, sorry about that. Normally when my uh, sibling comes home, they like to talk my ear off about their day. I had to remind them that I was streaming. So sorry about that few minutes of silence. We're back to it now. So, it's for the Pokedex. Yes. The Pokedex. I am astonished. Nice work, Sharon. You've already studied Pokemon extensively, haven't you? Do let me explain everything from the beginning for everyone else's sake. The Pokedex is a high-tech device that automatically records the Pokemon you encounter. So I want you three to visit many places and meet all of the Pokemon in the Udova region. This is my request. Well, I'm sorry about that, Professor uh, Juniper. You are not going to get a full Pokedex from me. Mizo, Sharon, Bianca. Why do I feel like my name there is very out of, uh... It is very out of place. You'll go on an adventure to complete the Pokedex, will you not? If we say no, she just repeats and repeats and repeats until you say yes, so we're just gonna say yes. <laughs> you know, uh, no one just imagining, like, Mizo being dressed in the, uh, the Pokemon Black main character outfit, just standing there looking nervous as they have, uh, replaced these two characters' best, best friends. Best friend. And I was just trying to keep their keep my identity secret. Try and not blow my cover or something. My braid is weird today. I'm so sorry. This stream will not probably be all too long. Because of that, my brain my braid is just huh. I'm having troubles today. I've been, yes, Professor. Thank you very much. Because of you, I can become a Pokemon trainer exactly as I've always wished. All of you, thanks. You have given me the best possible answer. Hey, a pink Pokedex. Next, I need to teach you how to meet Pokemon. Please meet me at Route 1, okay? Yeah, it's time for the catching tutorial and for the Nuzlocke to actually begin. Since the professor asked us, it's okay to go on an adventure, right? I'm sorry if you're seeing me constantly stop and mess with some kind of off screen. I have to mess with some settings to make sure lag doesn't persist in certain applications. I can explore and maybe find out what I'd like, what I want to do in life. I think I'd like that. Of course. We can travel however we want while we complete the Pokedex. Oh, it, Mom. Come on! Uh, Mizo, wait up! Oh, there you are! And what did the professor have to say? 
she asked you to complete the Pokedex. I can't believe it. I can't either, because it's not gonna happen. Well, actually, I can. I already knew she was going to ask. That's why I brought you three of these... That's why I brought you three of these town maps. Take them with you. We saw obtain the town map and put it in the key items case. There you are, Sharon. I'll take good care of it. And one for you too, Bianca. Thank you so much. As for your room, Miso, or what's left of it. No need for any of you to worry. I'll take care of tidying up. Okay, Mizo? Ah, uh, Pokemon. They're so cute, but they have enough power to destroy a bedroom. They really are something. If Pokemon like that just side, you'll be safe whenever you go. Wherever you go. I'll let your parents know. Hope that's... I hope that in addition to Pokemon, you'll find lots of places and uh, you'll like in the Unova region and become wonderful adults. Have a great trip. If I use the town map, I'll always know where I am. That's certainly helpful. Shall we head to run? The professor is waiting. Let's go, let's go. Miso, hurry up and come too, okay? Miso, it's this way. Bianca says that for starting a journey, she wants us all to take our first step at the same time. Hey, Mizo. Let's all take our first step on Route 1 together. Okay, here we go. One, two... I wonder what will happen. Isn't this so exciting? It sure is. Come on, the professor is waiting. Mother Juniper, I'm sorry to have kept you waiting. Tell everyone's here, I'll explain. The Pokedex pages update automatically whenever you meet a Pokemon. Moreover, it's set up so that you obtain even more information when you catch a Pokemon. To make this clear, I'm going to demonstrate how to catch a Pokemon. Here is the catching tutorial. A royal pet rat appeared. Oh right, she has a Mancino. So this is just, like, you know, normal catching twirl. You just sit through it. And they'll teach you how to, you know, do things and catch stuff. I'm not gonna bother reading this, because I'm... I am a somewhat experienced Pokemon player. I know how to do these things. I know how to catch Pokemon. I know how to... I play them with status effects, and I know how to adjust other stuff to, you know... Increase my chances of catching things. By no means am I on any level that I might actually pass this nose lock, though. I expect that's what I expect many of them. Did you 
see that just now. Wow. Thank you for the follow, friend. Welcome to the community well to chill. I am happy that you are here. Now, okay. Welcome, Mel. Hello. How are you doing today? Oh, and you came just in time for the uh, Discord to pop off. Apparently. Pretty decent? Pretty decent. Oh, well, I hope I can make that a little bit better. Here's how it goes step by step. First, reduce the Pokemon's HP. Pokemon that still have all their energy are difficult to catch. And if you can, use your Pokemon's moves to make a Pokemon you want to catch fall asleep or paralyze it. And to wrap this up, in the best way, I have a gift for you. Some Pokeballs. I have obtained Pokeballs. Pokeballs are used for catching Pokemon and for carrying the Pokemon you catch. I'm going on ahead. I'll be waiting for you in... A Cumula Town. He forgot to say that Pokemon jump out at you in the tall grass. I'm heading to Accumula Town too. I think I'll go too. I'm looking forward to the next town so I can go shopping for Pokeballs. Wait a minute. Hey, listen, Mizo, Sharon. Sorry, I had to sneeze. I muted my mic so I wouldn't, like, blow anyone's eardrums up. I'm doing pretty good. I'm doing pretty good. My mind is, like, all over the place today, but otherwise, I am A-OK. -okay. I thought of something fun. But we need to get going. I'd imagine the professor was laying do. But just listen a sec, seriously. I always see who can catch the most Pokemon. Well, that's certainly not gonna be me. The person carrying the most Pokemon, including the one received from Professor Juniper, is the winner. Huh. Actually, that sounds interesting. It'll fill out the Pokedex pages, so I'm sure it will please the professor, too. Okay, then. Until we reach your let down, take care of healing your Pokémon at your own house. Me and Oshawa will do the best for sure. And so it starts. We are gonna go ahead and... Save the game. Because I am just one of those people that likes to save frequently, honestly. Even if this is a Nuzlocke and I could die at literally any moment. Alright, here we go! We're about to take our first steps into the first route. And... Actually... How many routes are on the way to this next town? Oh, nope, not that one. We are on route number one, which means this is the only catch we get. What are we hoping for? Honestly, I would rather a uh, flying type rather than pat wrap. I definitely don't want pat wrap.
Well, that was uneventful. I still don't have running shoes! Alright, here we go. Here's our encounter for the route. It's a bad rat. The one thing I didn't want... It's okay. Ah, uh, so... No, just... We'll take anything we can get, honestly. Probably catch it with that. The only items for uh, no, I never put that restriction on actually. They just stay in the bowl. Okay, wonderful. Alright, as of that, we now have a pat rat. Would anyone like to be named after Pat Rat? Or would anyone like the pat rat named after them? Yes, we have to give it a nickname. It is a male pet rat. I think its max evolution is... Watchdog? Might be something else. All I remember is that pet rat was a fr uh, part of my official team until I got some of the ones I liked more. So it's not bad, but it's not good. Uh, let's see. If no one wants to volunteer to have the pet rat take their name, we will name you... I will name you... Francis. Yeah. Francis. I probably spelled that wrong. I'm gonna walk all the way back home. Because my Pokemon are in danger. Oh no! Net bad rat. It's a level 2 bad rat. I'm, uh. not interested. I am in. I'm currently in danger. I am not interested. Um, I need the rest of the Pokemon. Okay, so we are immediately going to put Francis in the front to start training him. I want to train him up to the point where, uh, Miko is. To at least level 6 before I actually move on from this area. So, I'm going to use a Thea. <laughs> Make sure that I deal more damage. And we hurt. Oh boy. Princess used tackle. Okay, so we just win. And this is a level 4 pet rat, so we're gonna get some decent EXP, I think.
Yes, this is the XP. There's gonna be like a lot of grinding throughout this uh, playthrough, so get ready. Ah, uh, little pup. I would have loved little pup. Little pup. Little pup. You would have been a great Pokemon to have. But sadly, I cannot have you. None to route to, at least. <laughs> oh, I'm slower. That's not good. Either that or it's a speed tie. Nope, I'm slower. That's not good. Ah, princess. Just to make sure we can't get crit checked, I'm gonna go heal up. The last thing I bought is another on... Oh, uh, people, in case you missed the first part of the stream. Uh, yeah, uh... The first attack that was thrown at me in the entire game was a crit. I, I was crit immediately. Which is, uh, I, it, it was startling, honestly. I could have lost my first battle immediately. I'd have to restart my run. Of course, they taught me with the little pup. That deals six damage, all oh, gods. Now, oh, it's a speed tie. So I don't think fear has priority. Another pet rip. I'll play this shut level Francis. What do you want? Yeah. People all are just trying to get my attention today and it's weird. Starter and my newly obtained are all on the same level. So, I'm gonna continue forward. How about it, Miso? Do you want to compare which one of us has the most Pokemon with them? Yes. I pressed B. I'm playing on an emulator, so I don't have, like, a DS in front of me. Uh... My Z key? My Z key is the B button, and I keep pressing Z when I'm supposed to be pressing X. Seems the number of Pokemon Mizo has... is two. We all have the same number, then. Incidentally, if you check your Pokedex, you'll see how many Pokemon you've found and how many you've caught. Uh, 
I'm off to Kimula Town. The professor is waiting. Thank you for the wet jeans. Ow. Ugh. Thank you for the wet jeans, little wanderer. Eh. Eh. Ah, yes, the X transceiver. Hello, how is everyone doing? You and your Pokemon are getting along great now, right? Oh, Professor! Right now, I'm in front of a Cumulus Town's Pokemon Center. I'd like to show you around, so hurry on over, everyone. Okay, the Pokemon Center, right? Okay, see you. Well, I'm going on ahead. Ah, Mizo, there you are. Traveling with your Pokemon is pretty one of the joys of being a trainer. Please follow me. I'd like to show you the most important place for a trainer to know. Is this the game where they start introducing shops in Pokemon centers? Yes. Okay, I think it is. At the least. This is a Pokemon center. Don't you feel better as soon as you step through the door? Okay, let's start your tour. for me. A Pokemon Center is a truly incredible place. Do you know why? Because your Pokemon can be healed! And what's more important is it's absolutely free. A Pokemon Center is a trainer's best friend. Here, me so give it a try. Hello, welcome to the Pokemon Center. I guess all your trained, your tired Pokemon to full health. I would like, would you like to rest your Pokemon? Okay, I'll take care of your Pokemon for a few seconds. Thank you for waiting. Thanks for starting your Pokemon to full health. We hope to see you again. Okay, now that your Pokemon have rested, I'll show you how to use the PC at the Pokemon Center. This is the PC. It's free for any trainer to use. You can start Pokemon in your PC boxes or select Pokemon stored in your PC boxes to take along with you. In addition, is you catch, if you catch a new Pokemon, while you have six Pokemon traveling with you, the Pokemon you just caught is sent automatically to the PC's network. Surprising, isn't it? Amazing, even. There's something else that's cool. If you select my PC, I'll evaluate the progress you've made on your Pokedex. Professor? It says someone's PC on the screen. Who is someone? Very good, Bianca. That's a great observation. question and I'd like to say more, but for now, just ignore that and go ahead and use the PC. Someone is the person who made the Pokemon storage system. Someone I'm sure you'll meet someday. Okay, let's move on. Now this is the Pokemart. Is it the place to buy useful items and sell ones you don't need anymore? The gentleman over there will help you with a smile. So, let's wrap this up. Have you and you the basics of being the trainer? I'm going to head back to... 
Nufema Town. Oh, one final thing. When you get to... Stridon City, go and meet an inventor named Fennel. She's a friend of mine from long ago, and I'm sure she'll help you along your way. The best of luck, I hope that your journeys prove to be an adventure of a lifetime. Oh, what should I buy? Potions and Pokeballs are definitely important. Um... Thinking... Yes, hello. I would like, uh, to buy stuff. Oh, that is the wrong item. I would like... Give me ten of these, please. Thank you. And the Premier Ball that comes with it. The rest of my money on purchasing in potions. God knows I'm gonna need them. They're having connection issues? Of course, this happens while I'm streaming. Uh, okay. That sucks. 